Alrighty guys, welcome back here to our part two of our Just the Tip series. We are out here um, in Muscle Shoals, Alabama at the Schoolmaster, part of the RTJ trail down here in Alabama. First installment of this Just the Tip series, so I mean, we're starting with a banger. This is a tough, tough course. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this series. We got a lot more coming out, so make sure to stay tuned for that. But we're gonna go see if we can't break 80 on this backside. Front nine took us to school. We're looking to take this back nine to school. All right, hole 10, gorgeous par three. Downhill, water left, bunker short, playing 230 yards back into the wind. I've got two iron and it's gonna take every freaking ounce of it to get there. I finally hit one, just get there. wind just munched it. Okay, firing two iron right at this pin. Just, I don't need to hit this thing full. Four iron just felt like I would have had to hit a screaming one, so just trust it. Oh yeah. Oh, be good. It's right at it. Be, be just fantastic. Go in. Oh. No, it's just short. Oh, oh. oh my lord. Oh gosh. That's that real, that's flagged. real good. Holy cow. All right, here's my approach shot in here. Checked up right there. Man, what a shot, I'm very happy with that. Just a pretty straightforward pitch shot. The lie's a little tight though. We're just gonna have to nip this thing. Or fat it, that works too. A little heavy. A little heavy. Okay, not what we were looking for on the chip shot, but we've got a putt at it. I've been putting the ball well, so I still feel pretty good. Wants to move just a hair of my right. Look at that. No way. You know, <laughs> I hate having the flag stick in and I always take it out because I see that happen. And then I decide, you know what? Just don't take it out. Look what I get. <sighs> take your flag sticks out, ladies and gentlemen. It does not help. It only hurts. I think personally it's the K-State top. <laughs> That's a fur. Okay, super pumped to hit this one in there real tight. Um, what an incredible hole too. But going just pretty much dead center, maybe favoring a little bit left side here, would be awesome to start with a two. There we go. Great putt. We'll take that. That is a, a good start. birdie, son. Back to three over, so we're taking her to school. Uh, number number 11 out here is 589 par 5. Pretty straightforward here. This this place looks really cool with how, how, how much the fairways pop. But honestly, one of the shorter par 5s, which is crazy. At the like, shortest par the 5. The shortest par 5. At 590. Yeah, at almost 600 yards. I mean, you just don't hear that very often. So let's see if Lando and I can uh, keep kicking away at Mr. Wilson here. There we Good go. Good swing. A little bleeder cut like that. For those who didn't know, the Schoolmaster, the name of the course, it is named after President Woodrow Wilson. So for those that didn't get that reference, there you go. Oh, I finally hit one on the driver. Just go. It's a little spinny. I don't know. We'll see. Alrighty, just off the fairway left here. We're just trying to beat a three wood out to the right. Get somewhere up there where we can have a scoring club in hand. Oh yeah, that's it. I think it's up there. Good spot here, throttle on the three wood up the right side. Let's make something happen, we're starting to feel, we got a good feeling about this back side. Come on, fly it. Can't tell. For those wondering, the divot is after impact. <laughs> <laughs> Not chunked. <laughs> Alrighty, 95 yards. I finally have a wedge in on a par five here, ladies and gentlemen. Got to attack, got to capitalize here. I've got a little 54 degree. I'm just gonna try to kind of flight one in there, feather it in there. Hopefully put myself in a good spot. Oh. 
Man, that stuff was weird. Did you see how that divot Grab came your out? Club. Yeah. Like totally grabbed it. Okay, we got about 60 yards here. Pretty hot lie. Got the 60 degree. We're gonna try to spin one in there tight. It's a tough shot. It's been hard. I'm not sure. Should have spun it, just kinda hopped on me. Alright folks, we finally have a birdie op. About 15 or 20 feet after that strange turf interaction from the fairway. Should be working just a hair left. And I just didn't even hit it. It's five though. Alrighty, this thing's really slinging uh, left to right pretty good. Just get the pace right. Come on. Oh! I mean, it was coming in with probably a little too much heat on her, but hey, we're not messing around out here. Okay, this is kind of my kryptonite right now. Let's see if we can trust one in there. There we go. Okay, but we'll take a five out of there. Good. Another, another part five coming, back to back. All right, we find ourselves in number 12 here, about a 618 par five. It's kind of cool, we got back-to-back -back par fives. This one's just a little dog leg left, very cool. It's, it's just framed by the trees all the way down there. Really cool hole, probably a pretty tough hole, so. See if the boys can't keep playing some good golf. I'll let you know when I start. I don't know what this keep, no all this keep nonsense is. <laughs> what? Well, that's just a slice swing. I think I'm gonna get away with it. I don't know that those trees are reachable. No, that's nope, okay. You're fine. Just, just not trusting that. <laughs> a little choppy. Okay. Blake's out there. Just trying to do the same. Wow. Just get over all of it. Money. Nah, it's just in the left rough, but it's fine. Okay. I don't even think the camera can capture how freaking cool this hole is, but the elevation change that we're going through right now is nuts. Just way downhill, then back up to the left. It's so, it's so cool, guys. If you're ever in this area, you gotta check this place out. But we're just, we're beating three. The ball's way above my feet, so kind of gotta watch out for the quick left. Just try to release one out right and, and trust it. They definitely protect it against the left. Give him a kick. Yeah, come on. I'll be fine. Yep, good shot. Okay, guys. Oh, oh I thought I was gonna hit you with that. <laughs> We've got three wood here. I'm just going kind of at that right side bunker and just beating it. Blake hit a good three wood down there, so that's the play. Oh my. Get left. Get it left. Lumber. Cart path. Leaves, I got it. Okay. Just right of the path. Cool. I have found the leaves. It was initially really scared because there's a lot of trouble over here, but it ended up working out. I have a perfect gap through here to the pin. 175, I've got seven in hand. The key is compressing it off this stuff. This stuff likes to fight it a little bit. So we just got to hit this one good. Uh, it kind of just came out weird. It's like dead. Okay. That's all right, it's in the front bunker. Beached. Yep. Got about 125 yards here. Got the little P wedge. It's time to score. You know, we're in, we're in A1 position here. It's time to, time to show this back nine who's boss. Got a little draw lie, so let's just trust it. Oh, this looks juicy. Sit. Sit there. Yeah, should be about pin high, a little left. Yeah, good shot. Thank you. Alrighty, folks, we have found the beach. Um, just didn't compress it off those leaves. It's hard to. Came up a little short. I'm just gonna, got a little 58 degree, try to bump her up there. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh. Wow. Oh. Sauce. Juicy. Sauce nation. Alrighty, we'll just clean this up here real quick. That shot had more sauce on it than a freaking salad bar.
Cars are like birdies today, folks. Like birdies. <laughs> Left to right out here for bird. Let's knock one in. Oh, low side. Low side Larry. That's all right. Yeah, Come just on. kind of scary. Kind of runs away from me after the hole. Who is this gonna cat? Guys, just take a second and appreciate. I mean, it's winter time and this course is still just beautiful. Like, just look at that back there. Incredible. Crazy hole, crazy place. Thumbs up to the schoolmaster. Get yourself down here, RTJ. Guys, a, a normal break on a course is like 400 yards for a par four. You know, you feel pretty good about it. Break on this course is 455, and that's what we've got ahead of us here. Just another absolute behemoth straight away up the hill. We just want to pound one up there. That's the name of the game. Wow. Oh, there it is. Lando might have found something. <laughs> might not even got over the hill, though. All right, last video, the light goal is 50. And hopefully you guys reach that. I'm not sure, that's in the future. But the goal today is 55. So if we see 55 likes on this video, you might just be seeing some more of just the tips. It's beat. Yeah, it's just not gonna run. Nothing does. Kinda did. I'm playing a little no spin low ball and that's not working too good today. I don't know if you guys can see down there, but there's this, I think it's a Tennessee River. You're the only town I see. But this river is just massive. Like, we don't have nothing like this in Kansas City. Like the Missouri River kind of looks sorry compared to this, I'll be honest. And it comes right up to the, to the coastline, which you can't see because it's way down in the trees. The place is just incredible. This was probably the best hit tee ball of the day. Really felt like I got after this one, but when it's uphill into the wind and soft, the seal only goes 250. I've got about 209 yards in here, kind of back into the wind. I've got just a four iron, just want to hit this one solid. That's the goal. Just pulled it dead left, man. Hopefully it cleared the bunker, but it might be in it. We'll see. Hit a pretty good drive out here. I got seven iron from 182. So uh, we'll just go in the middle of the green with this one, try to get out with four. Just keep hanging on. Be a good number, please. Yeah, kicked a little left. Yeah, it's kind of, I think it's just a little bit short. It's fine. Pulling. All righty, folks, we're in the bunker again here. We've got a lengthy bunker shot. I've elected to go with the 54 this time so that hopefully we can carry it a little bit farther. Go, get all the way there. Wow. Yeah, it's pretty good from that distance, Lando. All right, can't putt this one. We got some sprinkler head issues here. These are the shots that are freaking terrifying out here because Lando and I just don't have this at home. We're just gonna trust it. Got it to nip. We'll take that. That was a little low nibbler. We'll take the four and get the heck out. Okay, folks, this would be a heck of a Sandy. I think this thing's fairly straight. Just gotta put it on the right line. Come on. Just worked a little too far right. I think Blake gave me that one. I fair. think it's good. <laughs> we'll let the viewers decide. Car path only, we're carrying too much stuff. Welcome to 14 here at hole number 14 out here. This is absolutely gorgeous. Honestly, very terrifying because we have no idea what the clear is on that water there, but fantastic hole. One of the shorter ones out here at 417. Yeah, this is gonna be a challenge for the boys, especially the way the course is playing today and into the wind. Got a trust driver right here, probably more than any time in this round. Oh yeah. Dude, that is perfect. That's a dandy. Oh, no tea. 
Sweet. Literally perfect. Yeah, we'll take that. All right, Blake is just hit a beauty down there. I'm going to try to follow him. Oh yeah. A little higher trage. It might need to carry a little bit. Oh. Where is it? It's up. It's in the fairway. Okay, I didn't see it bounce. Okay, you're good. Good shot. Thanks. All right, guys. We hit one in the fairway. Uh, it was a little close to the water, but we're all right. I've got about 165 in here, probably 160, 165. I'm just going to hit a little baby 7-iron in there. Just want to make a good swing here. Give myself a look for birdie. That's what we need today. Or hit it skinny and probably over the green. Front, I didn't see that, Front fringe, it just plugged. Front fringe, it did? Yeah. Okay, okay playing this one about 130. I got a little pitching wedge. Just going to choke her down. Uh, just trust it. I think this is a good little scoring hole. I just get a little extra juiced up on these pretty holes. Down. Okay. Yeah, good shot. Yeah, about pin high left. So, came up a little short. Damn near missed it, but you gotta look. So, that's what we'll take. 30 feet probably up the hill. We'll give her a run. Hold your head and go. Just slow. Yep, I'll just clean it up, Blake. Okay. Good putt. Oh, we'll take four. Yeah, good part there. Okay, big left to right breaker here. I mean big. I'll play this thing out there a good bit. This would be an awesome little three. Let's make it happen. Stay up. Oh, wow. That falls off the earth. Yeah, it does. Holy a lot cow. Of slope. Yep. All right. That's okay. Good four. Even that thing moved. That's a little pin clapper for one of the best par fours I've seen. Hole 15 here, 447, Dog Lake right. This hole's a challenge. I just, I just tell Land, I feel like we're just getting bullied out here. Every hole. It just doesn't let up. It's non-stop. You gotta keep yourself in it. Let's see what the boys can do here. Take that. That's my best one of the day. Blake hit a good one up there. I'm trying to follow suit. I don't know. I mean, it was... It was hit well. Yeah. No idea. Just found the kind of the right rough up here. I've got a little weird side hill lie, but I've got 172 in. Um, I'm just going to hit a little baby six iron today. Just try to hit something solid and get it up near the green on it, hopefully. Darn it. 150 yards, playing a little bit uphill and the ball is just not flying too much. It's getting cold on us, so I got a 9 iron. Trust the little draw. A blind green here. We got no clue what's up there. Oh, that's my worst iron swing of the day. That's short too. Got some work cut out. All right, missed this one a little bit short left. Got a good look for an up and down though. Just got to hit a good shot here. Run up there a little more. Just slow. All right, we're pretty dead here. Side hill lie, no green to work with. It's gonna take a miracle shot here. There. Very sandy in this part. Oh. All right, didn't have too much of an option there. Um, just left ourselves with a little lag putt here. So just get our five and get out. Settle. Man, look at that peel away. Okay, this one for four. Just be huge. Oh, it's five. Okay, got this thing right edge. Let's finish this up here. Okay. 
We'll take a five. That's what happens when you dump a nine iron in the front bunker. Alrighty folks, we are here on hole number 16. Another gorgeous par three. It's playing about 195 here from the back tees today. Uh, there's a little bunker short of the green and kind of everything works down towards it, so it's kind of in a bowl. Uh, I've got five iron in hand. We're just gonna try to hit a good shot here. This is an awesome, awesome hole. I got the I got the five iron here. This is a really cool little hole, but good chance to score. Let's let's try to get one tight. This would be a really cool really cool hole to get one on. Oh, I just left it. I just completely let it go. And up on that hill. That's gonna be a lot of fun. Yeah, shot. Well. This is going to be something else, guys. I'm just going to try to open the face and uh, land it real soft in the front of the green. Now go, go, go. Wow. Not as fast as I thought. We'll take Freaking it. shot. All right, we need this one for three. This thing is going to want to dip on me. Wow. Holy movement. Gonna play a little bit more than the cup out. Gotta get it there. Look at that slide. Crazy pin. Damn. Sucks. Give two away in the last two holes. So we got some work to do. Okay, number 17. This one's cool. The lake's kind of off the right. It's almost like an island looking fairway down there because everything just falls off so hard from the trees. You gotta hit one. 443 more yards of par four on this one. I was hitting so hard. It's a hair left, but I think it's great cart golf. All right, Landon, I absolutely smoked that thing. So, a little bit of a draw hole. I've been kind of chopping across it today. So we gotta sit one on the slot and just trust it. Go. Oh, that's hard lumber. A little bit left. We'll, we'll see. All right, guys. Got 141 here. It's probably my best drive of the day as far as contact goes. Still a little left, but it's all right. Blake somehow hit the tree and is in the fairway. <laughs> so, you know what? It's just when it's not your day, it's not your day. I've got P wedge in hand. Just try to get something down there. Now sit. Be his day. Be my day. Okay, yeah, good shot. It's a little short. Wow, I thought that was all over. <laughs> all right, the golf gods were in my favor there. You know, I hooked it into these trees, but it kicked it right in the middle of the fairway for me. Hard lumber. <laughs> That's how it goes sometimes, though. I got pitching wedge, a little 130 shot down the hill. Make something happen. Gotta make up for those last two bogeys. Man, I'm just falling apart, man. I'm getting tired. Man, just really struggling right now. Got to stop the bleeding somehow. Let's hit a good one here. This sand out here is really good stuff. Pretty good shot. It's so hard from down there. That's as good as I can hit that. All right, we've got a look here. It's wants to swing a little bit to my right. Put her on the right line. Dig, baby, dig. All right. That's all right, I'll take that. Yep. Easy four. Maybe five. It was good. <laughs> good four. All right, this would be to slap a big old band-aid on my wound. It's breaking right to left. We really need to see one go. Oh! That's just sad, man. Oh, we're falling apart out here. <laughs> it was a great putt. Almost had a sponsored ad from Band-Aid. <laughs> oh, 
Alrighty guys, we are on 18 here, finally. 393 yard par four. Currently, as it sits, I am at 10 over for the day. I got bodied. I wanna get it in at 10, keep it at 10, maybe even try to get it to 11. And so this is gonna be the hole to do it. Blake is currently at six over. His dreams of breaking 80 are still alive. He needs to get out of here with a double or less, or sorry, bogey or less, and he can break 80. It's gonna be testament. We're tired, we're beat. It's been cart path only and 8,000 yards of golf today. It's a monster, but we're, we gotta finish strong. That's okay, yeah. Sounded like fairway, I just can't see. Yeah, Too dark. All right, bogeyed the last three holes. So, man, I'd love to go home with a little bit better of a taste in my mouth. But yeah, we can't afford anything more than a bogey here. And I'm only in front of the tee markers so that the uh, shot camera works better, sorry. Yeah, we don't want to hear it from you rule nerds. <laughs> uh, get down? Maybe sit? I just don't know. I can't see. I think I see a ball in the fairway. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah. I think we can cut one yard off of 8,000 just in, and not have to hear it from you guys today. <laughs> 145, playing 155 up this huge hill. This is a crazy finishing hole. Straight into the wind again. I've got eight. I think that's the number, but it's going to have to be flighted a hair. I'm going to start it right at that little patio. That's the plan. And it cut for me. Kick left. I think it's all right. Sounds like green. All right, we backspun that driver <laughs> about two yards. Absolutely mad. I got a pitching wedge, about 130. Let's go. Trust it. I'm just fighting the cut or the pull today, you know? I think that's gonna be fine. Should be putting. All right. A little cross country putt here to finish her off. I think she should just want to work hair to the right once it gets down towards the hole. I'll take that one. If you saw my 82 today, no you didn't. Okay, this one for Birdie here. I think it should break to the water. Deep. We'll take it. Just tap her in, Def sir. Definitely broke to the water. Yeah, tap her in for the 78. Is that what this is for? Gosh. That's what it's for. There yep. it is. 78. Good stuff. Normally 78 would really be unhappy, but that's all right. We'll take it today. Alrighty, guys. That is going to put a wrap on our battle out here. That's that's probably the appropriate word for it. <laughs> yeah. At uh, the Schoolmaster course here in Muscle Shoals. What a course. I mean, absolutely beautiful, absolutely treacherous, and absolutely longer than anything I've ever played in my entire life. <laughs> Mental. It was crazy out here, but we had, a, we had a good time, you know. I know Landon's not as happy with how he played, but you know, it's it's hard to fight out here, especially with how wet it was. Like. The, the yardage and the score, or like, it's not reflective of how hard the course really played today with it being wet and cold. I mean, crazy. Yeah, it was brutal. I mean, par fours, like, I think eight iron was like the lowest I hit into all these things. It was just yeah. like four iron after four iron after four iron. And when you're not playing a lot of golf like we haven't been, that'll wear on you quick. Absolutely. <laughs> it was a good time. Hope you guys enjoyed this series. I mean, we got a lot, we got more of this coming your way of the, the Just the Tip series. So thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. Yeah. yeah. Hopefully you guys like watching us get beat up because there's going to be plenty more of it on our Just a Tip series. So stay tuned for all that if you like watching us struggle. Absolutely. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching.